Hey guys, welcome back to another Clash Royale video, and today we have the brand new Mini P.E.K.K.A. Draft Challenge, as you can see over here, which at six wins unlocks a brand new Dancing Mini P.E.K.K.A. emote, which personally is one of my favorite emotes in the game. It is uh, honestly really, really cool, uh, and I'm actually really happy that Supercell is giving us more opportunities to earn emotes for free, uh, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that as well. So we're going to go ahead use our free entry and uh, jump into our first battle of the evening. Now, this is a draft challenge as uh, as it is. We're gonna go actually Inferno D over that. We'll kind of see how it goes. Uh, I'm gonna go Rascals because they're more lightning spell resistant than, uh, than that. And I kind of want to go, I don't know, Balloon or... We're gonna, we're gonna try Balloon. He has Executioner and lightning spell, but we have Log and Rascals, both which do a decent work versus the Hogs. Plus, I think I think the Balloon is a bit easier. Ooh, got Lava Loon. All right. The Balloon's a bit easier, versus the, whereas the Log can be, or the the Hog Sword can be a bit a bit iffy. Not with those Bats in there, though. Ooh, nice. There we go. Get those Hogs down, please. I want to try and get a Balloon. He's going to execute. This is perfect execution of value. The one thing I don't, I don't like so far about my deck is I'm seeing a lot of Swarm. We have Rascals, Spear Goblins, Goblin Gang, and Skeletons, which, uh, honestly, is not going to be the most fun when it comes down to taking care of this Executioner. Is here? Nice. Yeah, we got a lot of Swarm, but basically all of our support is Swarm. What are the odds of that happening, guys, in Draft, where all of the support is uh, Swarm, and they get Executioner? Like, what are the odds of that happening? Now, here's the thing, guys. Here's the thing. We're gonna go Lava Hound here. Normally, I would do a live stream for this kind of a challenge. Uh, normally, I live stream all the special event challenges when they go live. Um, but with this one being... That was weird. With this one being um, six wins only, I figured the, the live stream would be like, I don't know, not very long. So I figured we would just kind of chill with that. It'd be like a 20 minute live stream, so I figured maybe it'd fit better in a video. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Maybe maybe I'm right, maybe I'm wrong. Infernal D here. Come on. Nice. Executioner's dead. Some swarm doing some work to the tower there. That should be a dead tower, maybe? Yeah, that's, that's a dead tower. So yeah, normally I would live stream a challenge like this, guys, but I figure with it being six wins, 20 minute live stream would be a bit weird. So I it better suited for a video. We'll kind of try how it goes. Let me know if you guys enjoy this kind of video at all, uh, if you find it helpful. Um, it's not like a challenge that you build a deck, so I don't really have a deck to share with you guys. Uh, so honestly, if you if you don't enjoy the challenge, that feedback is also useful for me. So just let me know if you enjoy this video or if you if you don't enjoy it. Like I said, guys, that kind of uh, that kind of feedback is also useful for me. Infernal here for this. I'll back the uh, the piggies here. Spears here for the. Uh, for the, the minions there. That way the balloon gets some, get some damage done. Because we will lose that tower. So I want to get the other tower going down there. And I want to go... Uh, Rascal's right here. I was going to say recruits. I uh, almost said recruits, guys. But you guys told me no, not to. We got two... Oh, look. Mini Pekka here. Lock it back. Lock it back. Nice. There we go. Three crown victory. Shane, pay attention. All right. There we go. Solid dub. That's what I get for recording at 1.30 in the morning. But yeah. Anyways, guys. Let me know if you enjoyed this video. Uh, doing this draft challenge is a bit different than what I would normally do. But honestly, I figured in lieu of a stream, we'll do a video uh, and just kind of see how it goes. So, Mr. Tony Stark. Ooh, I'm going to go Poison. Oh, ho, 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 with Sparky. Man, with so many... What, what's going on here? Um, I don't know. That's a tough choice. Our deck is getting expensive, so I want to go with the Hog Rider, but the Royal Hogs work better with the recruits for the split lane pressure. I don't know, what would you guys have chose there? It's a tough call. By the way, guys, if you are interested, uh, I have subscriber clans in Clash Royale and Clash of Clans, if you guys play Clash of Clans. So if you're interested in joining any of my subscriber clans, their information is in the description down below. And there currently is limited space available in all of my clans. So if you are interested in joining, now is the time to do so. 
We're gonna go Sparky over here. Hopefully it doesn't have a rocket. Sometimes they do. Sometimes they don't. I'm expecting some piggies over here. We're gonna go like this. e bars get some work done there. Nice. We're gonna go Hunter here as well. The Hunter Splash should help take care of the recruits. And we're gonna go Ice Golem here for this. Nice. The spark can get what the hunter's gonna stand there and not shoot, but the spark is gonna. Oh, the fire spirit's going down. All right, E Barb. Oh, the ice golem tanker for the E Barb. He gets in there. Get some. We're gonna go hog here, guys. Keep the pressure up. That E Barb getting some work done. Hunter shooting. The hog rider getting some damage done as well. This should be a dead tower there, boys and girls. The, the one problem that I'm noticing so far. Oh, no. Camera two. Right here. The one problem I'm noticing so far with this deck. Actually, we're gonna go Sparkinator for the, uh... Do I wanna go Sparky? Let's go Sparkinator for that. Uh, cause it'll kill the Spear and then kinda build up a bigger push. We might go Golem in front. We'll kinda see how it goes. I don't know. I haven't really decided yet. There's the Recruits. This Actually, we're just gonna poison this Jazz. This should take the shield off the Recruits, allowing the, uh, thing to do some stuff. Wait for it. Hunter here. Pull these recruits over. Hunter, kill the uh, fly machine, please. Or, you know what? Just die. Uh, that's okay by me. That's actually a pretty nut play. Expo here. Nice. That pulls the recruit over and distracts the uh, hogs. Gonna go E barbs here for this. Then potentially poison the skeleton barrel. Actually, we should be good. Yeah, we good. No poison needed, guys. We good, we good, we good. It's a good defense right there. Yeah, so if you guys are interested in joining my subscriber clans, information is down in the description below. And, uh, should have a jolly, uh, jolly old time. That's not poison value, so we're not going to poison it. We're going to focus on defending the left lane right here. And then get an uh, expo up right here. Oh, -ho -ho -ho! look at this. The spark, you're just doing the work. It's going to kill the hogs too. Boom. Nice. All right. Now we go uh, Golem in front right here. That takes care of the uh, that. And I think we got ourselves a good game here, boys. Yeah. There we go. GG's. By the way, guys, uh, how are you doing so far in this challenge? How are you doing in this challenge? Is it good? Did you get the, did you get the emote yet? If not, I hope you do. I have no idea yet what the emote, uh, what the gem re-entry cost is. Um, but if you guys know, feel free to share it down below. Or if I find out before... Oh, it's a tough call, boys. Goblin Giant or Mega... Ah. Uh, that really... We're gonna go Mega Knight. I really don't appreciate those draft choices. Because, I don't know, I just don't think a win condition should be compared... We're going to go, we're going to go Ice Golem. I don't want his Ice Golem pulling my Mega Knight over. But I don't think a Mega Knight should be paired up with a Goblin Giant. One's a win condition and one is a heavy defense. They are not similar in the slightest. So it should be like, you should be able to choose Mega Knight, Giant Skeleton, or P.E.K.K.A., right? Like three massive defensive cards should be the draft choice. It shouldn't be win condition or non-win condition. I don't know. That's my thought. Honestly, I think there's there's some serious improvements that could be made to draft overall. Namely, one thing I would suggest doing for draft for them is make it so you draft all Avery cards at once. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go Ram Rider here. See what he has for it. Here goblins. Rascals. If that Ram Rider can take care of one of the Rascal girls, unfortunately he won't. We're gonna go Mega Knight here like this. Once it locks onto our top, we're gonna go minions right here. Wait for the Goblin Giant to lock on and then go minions. It's gonna take some massive damage to that one though. Mega Knight will jump on the uh, tower. Get some damage done. Nice, baby. Ooh, that's a tough E-bar split there. What you got here? Log value. Log value, guys. Totally. You know what? That sucks. If the mini P.E.K.K.A. and the tower would have took it the same E-bar, e I wouldn't have needed that, uh, that the uh, Ice Golem there. But the Mini Pekka and the Tower targeted opposite E-Barbs. And uh, as a result, they did work. But it is what it is, and you can't be what you can't be. So, ooh, right there. That, 
my friends, is a Goblin Giant. We're gonna go Prince here. Should take care of it pretty nicely. I'm hoping it goes Rascals in front. Uh, no. Rascals there. Alright. Wait for it. Minions here. I'm gonna go Mini Pika here. Wait for it. Mini Pika doing work. Ram Rider here. Lock back some E-Barbs here. Arrows this Jazz. A bit aggressive, you might be saying, Shane. You're playing really aggressive right now. But it might work out in our favor. Pull it. Never mind. Prince here. We pulled one over. What a nub. Minions here. We're playing a bit bad right now. But we might be able to hold on for the dub. There we go. There we go. All right. So, I think we're looking pretty good here. Does he give up? Ram Rider here, I guess. I know we're full on Elixir. But I think our friend... Gave up. Yeah. Basically, basically confirmed at this point. We had a pretty legit deck. Um, a bit low in the air defense, so good thing he didn't have a balloon deck. But, uh... Let me pick a ram right. is going to ram, and the tower is not going to go down. Good game. So, 3 for 3 so far. Doing pretty well. Don't want to jinx it, though. Knock on the wood. So hopefully, we don't jinx it. There we go. But we'll keep on going, keep on going, and keep those... Ooh. Zap. I think Zap's more versatile. Oh, where do you go, Goblin Barrel? I, 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 ooh. I'm going to go... Valkyrie, because it counters Goblin Barrel, and it counters with the... I don't like my choices, guys. I would have gone Princess as well there for that log bait, but he's got Balloon, and I need air defense, so I chose the Ice Wizzy... I'm thinking I should have got the Rascals there. The problem with that choice is Valkyrie counters... Valkyrie counters the Rascals and the Goblin Barrel. So I feel like choosing the Valkyrie maybe would have been better. I have no idea. I kind of regret some of these choices at this point. We'll kind of see how it goes, though. Wait for it. Hopefully the Minipikin can kill that Magic Archer as well. But I don't think he will. He's going to die right now. Yeah. But honestly, we're going to gonna Far Bolt right here. Then we're going to go Bats for this. Should hopefully be good. With a Goblin Barrel right here. He's going to go Princess. The Goblin's going to stab. Got some decent Stabby Stabby there. This is going to be a definitely a stressful battle for me though. We don't have adequate air defense. Still unsure if choosing the um, the Valkyrie over the Rascals was a good choice. Let me know what you guys would have done for any of these drafts. But the Valkyrie, like when the Rascals cross the bridge, the Valkyrie is such a counter. But I feel like Rascals would have been good as a like bait card. I don't know, guys. I think overall we made some made some mistakes with our drafting. All right, what do you got? What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? Belton's get just a few stabs, please. No? One stab? Two stabs. Alright. That's a few. I can't complain about that. I'm just gonna go mini Pekka. Bats barrel. Bats for the guards. Barrel for the tower. Mini Pekka for something. Nice. That was a bit aggressive. I'm hoping we can survive this push right here. Because we, we literally have no air defense. Because he goes Balloon here. We dead. He's got Rocket too? That's disgusting, dude. Who gave you that deck? I didn't give you Rocket, that's for sure. Here we go. Maybe I can kill the Princess? Ah. That sucks, dude. That sucks. That really sucks. This here. I suppose he here. Or I blow it back. That way, no death damage. Oh, I just realized he's got... He's got lightning and... One of these. One of these. Lightning and rocket he's got, guys. That's nasty. That's nasty, dude. Zap. One more stab. Oh, so close. So close. So close. We can do it, baby. There we go. Good game. Wow. That was stressful. Indeed, it was. So, solid dub, solid dub. 
There we go, there we go. We got four wins so far. And some gold. All right, guys, we got two more wins needed. We can go ahead. Oh my goodness, why did they keep doing this? Mega Knight and RG are not in the same class. We're gonna go Mega Knight. We'll get the hope it works. L Jack to kill the RG. Mini Pickup because it's better than the E Barbs. And Ice Golem to pull the E Barbs over. I really don't think the Mega Knight belongs in the same draft as the Royal Giant. They're completely opposite. One targets a tower, one destroys swarm units. Three Musketeers should be removed from the game until they're fixed. You should not be getting Three Musketeers in a draft. Just gonna go ahead and say that right now. But we're gonna try some Musketeers right here. Hopefully my 11 electric cost Musketeers... Nope, he's got poison. Uh, I really don't think Mega Knight and RG should be in the same draft. At all, boys and girls. But I could just be crazy. Wizard in the house? Taking care of my... Um, my skeletons. Uh, I don't like this. This is scaring me. Boom. Nice. We need to kill the wizard. Kill the wizard. No. That's insane damage. That's, that's a. T uh, that's a dead tower, boys. Or close to it. This is a really bad draft here. We got three musketeers and mega knight. I'm basically not planning on using the Three Musketeers at all this entire battle. Because they are uh, not very good right now. There's no way we can de because there's no way we can defend that tower from dying, so I'm gonna save the elixir. Build up hopefully a bigger, beefier, juicier push right here. Cannon cart. He's a wizard. I can spell this. There we go. Nice. Mega Knight Rage should finish the tower off there. So I think trading that tower was uh, probably the best option for us. And I also think never using Three Musketeers this battle is as well uh, one of the better options for us, guys. Let me know if you disagree. But, uh... I tend to be agreeing with myself right now. Mega Knight here. Boom. Nice. Where's your wizard? Is here. Raging it up, raging it up. Any pick I do work, wizard please? Yes, tower goes down. What are you poisoning? You can't poison that. What are you doing, dude? We're gonna go all in here, boys. Going all the way in. Power should go down here. Yep, all right. We played pretty well for that one, considering our cards. But, uh, yeah, Three Musketeers should definitely not be in the draft when uh, they're in the current state they are. And uh, I really think Mega Knight should not be in the... I know, I'll stop saying it, guys. Lightning chest. Don't need anything. And here we go. Moment of truth, guys. Moment of truth. What do you guys think? Am I crazy? Or, or do you agree with me? Should Mega Knight and... Um, the art, like Mega Knight and Wing Condition shouldn't be together, I think. I don't know. Let me know if you guys agree or disagree. Either way. Uh, stuff. Oh, we're so going Sparky. Sparky RG. There's no way you can say no to the Sparky RG. I hope I got, I hope I got Zaspo. Hmm. I don't know, guys. What do you think? Sparkinator or the RG? RG... To the RG, to the RG, to the RG. Ice Wizzy, to the Ice Wizzy. What you got, dude? You've got a bit of a goblin gang there. Sparky here with an RG in front, why not? Wait for it, boys. If he has Rocket, I'm gonna cry. Please don't have Rocket. Nice. Eh. Sparky, please survive. I can't, su I can't remember if Sparky survives a giant boom. Eh. Oh, the value! The value with the Hog Rider! What are you doing? Deja Vu! What are you doing? Dude! What was that? 
What was that hog rider? Oh my goodness, I can't even. I so totally can't even right now. That Sparky got- Wow! <laughs> yeah. I can't believe how much value that Sparky got. Why was I so high pitched there? I don't even know. I can't believe that Sparky was the best Sparky I've ever Sparkied in my career, guys. You've literally never seen a better Sparky than right there. So, uh, that's doing some work. Prince here for this. Honestly, let's just fool around with this guy for a bit. Prince is going to charge the main e -Pico. The only thing that's kind of unfortunate with our deck is we have nothing for the Skarmy. Which is rather unfortunate. But if he goes hog right lane, we're easily set up here for a potential... Um... Look at that spark. He's like, who do I shoot? Valkyrie or hog rider? Which one do we shoot? And the Valkyrie... Now, now we go hog rider. He's like, sorry, let me just clean up on aisle three. Sparky coming in clutch. Somebody give the Sparky a raise, please. He's going to go scar me here. Magic Archer's going to clean the house. Magic Archer, there we go. How is cleaning being done? Send the bill to 123 Magic Archer Street. Because that was some fine cleaning, my man. What even is my commentary today? I don't know, but that's what happens when I record at 2 in the morning. Sparky's going to shoot. Yes. No. Sparky. You're dead. You'll be missed. Oh, and the arch. He finishes him off. Wow, guys. Undefeated six wins draft challenge. All right. Well, there we go. Emote is unlocked. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Pretty cool, I'd say. I don't know. I don't know what you guys think. But I think it's a... Uh, Pretty solid emote. One of the best, I would dare say. All right, guys. So to finish the video off over here, we have collect the emote. Boom. There we go. We have right here, open up our draft challenge chest for a whopping 900 gold. Three Valkyries, 31 Rascals, and a mirror. Best chest ever. <laughs> Honestly, guys, it's... Oh, 20 gem re-entry. There you go. For anyone wondering the re-entry, guys, it is 20 gems. Honestly, it's really, really cool that they're giving us a, an, an option to earn emotes for free. I'm definitely happy with that. All right, guys, let's very quickly to end the video off. We got a uh, crown chest to open up over here with nothing crazy in it. And then we have a new emote to throw in our deck because uh, this one is pretty cool. I want to get rid of the... These are all pretty cool. I think the flexing. Because you got you to gotta dab on the haters. Whenever you have a solid idea, like whenever your opponent, <laughs> I love using this emote when your opponent makes like a really, really like mis a big mistake, like an obvious mistake. You go like, huh, that was a great idea, like sarcastically. Uh, this one, when I go, hmm, when I make a questionable play or like nobody's making the opening play. Stabby stabby is when you're winning. This is when you uh, make uh, a really bad play, like you're ashamed of yourself or they do. Uh, dabbing the haters, I said already. Laughing when you win. Screaming when something uh, scares you. And now dancing when you want to dance. I don't know. <laughs> when do you dance, guys? When the battle is just so crazy, you got to bust out and dance, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, guys, that is the end of the video. Let me know if you enjoyed this style of video down in those comments below. Uh, it's a bit different than what I normally do. Normally, it's like a deck. Like if, it's, if, it's, if you build a deck for a challenge, I'll share a video on a good deck. But this one was just me playing and having some fun. So did you guys enjoy it? Should I do more of that? Or would you, pref uh, would you prefer I stick to the usual? Anyways, guys, that is the end of the video. Really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe to some more Clash Royale content. Thanks so much for watching, guys. We'll see you in the next one.